Yeah, what up, boxing fans? I got to thinking, and I thought to myself, what if Floyd Mayweather didn't weight drain Canelo, Canelo Alvarez? And I want you guys to hear um, what Andrew Garcia had to say about weight draining Canelo Alvarez. You think that's what happened in the Canelo fight when Floyd fought Canelo at 152? Yeah, exactly. It destroyed Canelo. It, it brought him down. It made him weak because he didn't have that impact. And it made him slow because his muscle dehydrated because you need that fluid. You take that fluid away, man. We humans. And what happens, you could go without food, man. You could starve yourself and don't die. And as long as you drink water, you take the water where you cure the human body right up. Exactly. Um... Shout out to Angel Garcia. I usually don't see eye to eye with him on everything that he says. But um, on this, he was 100% spot on. Um, he explained that Canelo was weight drained in the Mayweather fight. He explained how Canelo was slower because he was weight drained. Angel Garcia also explains uh, when you're weight drained and dehydrated and starved, your, ref your reflexes slow down. Um, you're slower in the ring and you're not going to be the same fighter that you would usually be. And um, I think Angel Garcia explained that uh, perfectly well about Canelo being weight drained in the Mayweather fight. And um, I just got to thinking to myself, what if Canelo wasn't weight drained in the Mayweather fight? I mean, Canelo was an undefeated fighter going into that fight. He had never lost a fight. And the only loss on his record, I believe there was a split decision. Was it a split decision? Um, I got to go back and look at the scorecards again. But I think it was a split decision, something like that. Uh, one judge made might have had it a draw. And the other two judges gave it to Mayweather. Uh, I think that's how it went. But um, I got to thinking to myself, what if Canelo wasn't weight drained? Um, and it's real interesting to think who would have won that fight. Because like I said before, Canelo was an undefeated fighter who, who had never lost a fight. And you got to put an asterisk on that Mayweather win. And because Mayweather will even tell you himself. I'm, I'm going to go back and use Floyd Mayweather words against him. Because one thing about YouTube, when you say some shit, when you say some shit, your words are recorded. And, um... Uh, Right here, I'm going to play with you guys. I'm going to play you guys what Floyd Mayweather had to say about weight draining fighters. Top competition. Um, he's one of the best fighters out there. Uh, I mean, I look at Miguel Cotto as an undefeated fighter because, you know, he faced Pacquiao, but Pacquiao caught him at a catch weight. It wasn't the best. Um, he's one of the best fighters out there. Uh, I mean, I look at Miguel Cotto as an undefeated fighter because, you know, he faced Pacquiao, but Pacquiao caught him at a catch weight. As an undefeated fighter because, you know, he faced Pacquiao, but Pacquiao caught him at a catch weight. It wasn't the best Miguel Cotto. He was drained. He wasn't hydrated. Okay. This, okay. This, this, this wasn't Roger, Roger Mayweather. This wasn't Floyd Sr. This was Floyd Mayweather. Who said uh, Manny Pacquiao weight drained Canel weight drained Miguel Cotto? Makoto wasn't hydrated. Let's play it back again because someone might not believe. They might not believe that there was this was Floyd Mayweather who said this now. So I'm I'm gonna play it back again. He faced Pacquiao, but Pacquiao caught him at a catch weight. It wasn't the best Miguel Cotto. He was drained. He wasn't hydrated. Um, Antonio Margarito. Nah. That it, it, it looks like Floyd Mayweather. It sounds like Floyd Mayweather. Motherfucker, it is Floyd Mayweather. Floyd Mayweather said that Manny Pacquiao weight drained Miguel Cotto. He said Miguel Cotto wasn't at his best. Miguel, Miguel Cotto was dehydrated. And Floyd Mayweather said he sees Miguel Cotto as an undefeated fighter. Now, those were his words. When I look at this video, I'm looking dead at Floyd Mayweather. Now, I dare anybody to dispute Floyd Mayweather's words. He said Miguel Cotto is an undefeated fighter. Did he or did he not say that? So, if Miguel Cotto is an undefeated fighter, 
then Canelo Alvarez is an undefeated fighter. And I had a motherfucker in the comment section tell me, I don't know shit about boxing. Well, didn't Floyd Mayweather just say, say the same shit that I said? So does, does Floyd Mayweather know something about boxing? V.A. Hoss? Yeah, I'm calling you out V.A. Hoss. Because he said the same shit that I said. The same exact shit. That Canelo is an undefeated fighter. When you weight drain a motherfucker and dehydrate a fighter, like Andrew Garcia pointed out, there's an asterisk to that win, man. You can't feel good about yourself weight, weight draining another motherfucker, man. And I agree with Floyd Mayweather. At that time, Miguel Cotto was an undefeated fighter because Antonio Margarito put rocks in his gloves and Pacquiao weight drained Canelo. So, Floyd Mayweather, you was 100%. You was 100% right about what you said. And what I'm finna say right now is um, Canelo is an undefeated fighter. He's an undefeated fighter in my opinion. Just like Mayweather said. So um, I, I would like to see a rematch between Canelo and Mayweather at 155 or 154. So we can um, to see who, who, who would really, who really would have won that fight. Had Canelo not been weight drained. Had Canelo, Canelo not been dehydrated. Had Canelo not been starved to death. Because we know to make the to make that weight, Canelo had to starve himself. He couldn't drink no water. And Mayweather took advantage of that, man. He took advantage of a weight drain fighter who could not eat, who could not drink water. As Angel Garcia pointed out early in the video. So I asked the fans. If Canelo wasn't weight drained, who would have won that fight? Mayweather or Canelo? Who would you guys have picked to win that fight? So uh, leave your comments in the comment section. 